Angelina Jolie returns to spotlight for first time since bitter divorce to campaign for children at International Criminal Court. Angelina Jolie recorded a video message for the International Criminal Court on Friday to coincide with the Dutch-based tribunal's launch of its policy on children. Successful prosecution, whether at the ICC or elsewhere is part of the long and vital generational effort. That is the light in which I believe the court's new policy on children should be seen, the 41-year-old Oscar winner said in a clip captured on Twitter. I particularly welcome the commitment to include charges for crimes against children wherever the evidence permits as part of a more systematic approach. I congratulate the Office of the Chief Prosecutor, and all those working on the policy. The Special Envoy for the UN High Commissioner for Refugees also stated, Mankind owes to children. We know we aren't giving the best to children. There can be no complete justice without consideration for the victims of the war crimes themselves, and the practical assistance they need to move on with their lives and overcome the harm they have suffered, Angelina noted. That is why the work of the Trust Fund is important and must be supported and strengthened over time. Jolie had previously visited the ICC in The Hague back in April where she met with staff from the Trust Fund for Victims. It was the first public appearance for the Kung Fu Panda 3 actress since filing for divorce from her third husband Brad Pitt on September 19. Angie is requesting full custody of their six children, Maddox, 15, Pax, 12, Zahra, 11, Shiloh, 10, and twins Vivian and Knox, 8. And while the L.A. County Department of Children and Family Services has cleared the 52-year-old Oscar winner, the FBI is still investigating his alleged altercation with Maddox on a private jet. The By the Sea director recently helmed a film about human rights activist Langung, which Netflix will stream next year.